introducing a brand new mathematics resource for Grand Deary teachers, Teaching and Learning Mathematics. Teaching and Learning Mathematics is a resource that has been created for Grand Erie educators and students to support mathematics instruction, learning, belonging, and well-being. This is a Grand Erie resource for grades 1 to 8 educators and has been developed using Brightspace. Teaching and Learning Mathematics was developed using the Ministry of Education's Long Range Plans by Topic. Each grade includes a suggested sequence of learning for the entire year. We know our students come to us with a wide range of learning experiences, so for the first 10 days of the Long Range Plans, there is a focus on building the learning community creating a safe and inclusive environment to support belonging, learning, and well-being in our classrooms. This will do two things. It will give us an opportunity to get to know our students, who they are and what they need. And for students, it will build trust in their environment as they experience the space that is being created for them to learn in. The long range plans from the ministry suggest a sequence of mathematics learning with topics and a suggested number of days for each topic. Teaching and learning mathematics provides lessons for each of the topics and for many of the suggested days. This is a resource that acts as a foundation from which you can build further instruction on. Included in each lesson of this resource are A great continuum for each of the focus expectations that shows the previous grade, the current grade, and future grade. This will help us to determine a starting point for where our students might be in their learning. And it also situates the expectation so that we can see how this expectation develops over time. There are key concepts listed that describe the essential understandings that we want students to develop. Key Concepts gives us a deeper level of the underlying conceptual understanding for each specific expectation. And this allows us to create tasks and learning experiences that will support students to construct meaning with mathematics. There are suggested learning goals and success criteria to help you and your students share an understanding of what is being learned and what success will look like when the learning goals are met. These are only suggestions that you could consider as you develop these with your students at the appropriate time. Assessment for learning informed by our learning goals and success criteria guides our instructional decisions. This resource provides suggestions for assessment opportunities, including pre-assessments, formative assessments, and tracking sheets. To continue the building of the mathematics community, there are connections throughout the long range plans to social emotional learning and process expectations that will continue the routines you have already established to support student learning. A list of suggested materials, including appropriate models and tools, as well as links to resources and videos to support student learning are available in each lesson. Lessons are organized using a three-part lesson model and include Minds on Tasks to encourage student thinking and connecting to prior knowledge. After the Minds on, students will have a chance to work on some tasks that will engage them in problem solving, reasoning, proving, selecting tools, strategizing, representing, and communicating, all to support them doing the math and making meaning with math. In the consolidation component of the lesson, there are ideas for consolidating the learning through a whole group discussion that makes connections between the learning experience and the key mathematical ideas. After each lesson, there are suggestions for differentiated, purposeful individual practice. 
As educators, this is our opportunity to respond to the student needs we've identified and link it back to the feedback we have given our students as they progress towards the learning goals and success criteria. Each lesson finishes off with a suggestion for student reflection and self-assessment. This is an opportunity for students to share their voice in their own learning and gives them an opportunity to develop the skills they will need to be agents of their own learning. Teaching and Learning Mathematics will be released at the end of June with September and October resources. The other months will be released throughout the upcoming school year. This will give you a chance to take a look at them, spend some time, and plan with them.